What's up guys, I'm Chase Brogan and today in this video we are checking out a seriously powerful new laptop from Nemo. This is the 17.3 inch Ryzen AI9 HX370 model. This thing is built for creators, gamers, and anyone who wants raw performance packed into a sleek portable setup. Let's hit the key specs before we crack this thing open and check out the layout and design. First and foremost, we have that 17.3 inch full HD IPS anti-glare display on here with silky smooth 144 hertz refresh rate. We also have the latest AMD Ryzen AI9 HX370 processor. We have Radeon 890M graphics featuring 50 TOPS NPU for AI powered performance boosts. We also have 32 gigabytes of DDR5 RAM on here, which is unsoldered, meaning that this is fully upgradable. We also have a one terabyte SSD installed within here, running Windows 11 Home. Now connectivity wise, it's fully modern. We have Wi-Fi 6, we have Bluetooth 5.2, we have a backlit English keyboard on here with our numeric keypad, which for me is a game changer. I have to have the keypad on here. And we even have a fingerprint sensor on here for one touch login. Now, in terms of power, we have a 75 watt hour battery in here that also is paired with a 100 watt USB-C PD fast charger so you can top up quickly and get back to work or play with minimal downtime. Now, as we unbox this, we're gonna take a closer look at the layout design and all the available ports. So let's unbox this and dive into this laptop. All right, so very nicely padded, as you can see, tons of padding inside of here. On top, we have what I assume is gonna be all of our cable connections. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up first, and then we'll dive into the laptop next. All right, so right here, we just have our power supply cable. Now this is going to be a type C to type C. One end is gonna plug into the laptop itself. Other end is going to plug directly into the brick right here which is going to go into your power outlet. So again, backside of this type C connection, connect that cable over, other end goes right into the PC. So we also have a user manual right here, which I always like to thumb through just to see how thorough they are with walking through the setup process. So user manual, there's a QR code on here for support from Nemo. If we open this up, it walks through the layout effectively. Love the graphics on here. I'm a visual learner, so this is huge. Walks through all of the available ports on here, which we're gonna do momentarily. Matter of fact, let's dive into that right now. So we'll set that aside. We'll continue opening up our 17.3 inch laptop. So very sleek design, all metal. This isn't cheap plastic. This feels durable, decent amount of weight to it. If we take a look on the side, ports over there. Take a look on the other side. We have some additional ones here. Opening this up, we have that anti-glare screen on here, which is incredible. And we have our full keyboard with our numeric pad over here on the right-hand side. And I love that for entering in like passcodes or credit card numbers. It just makes everything so much easier over here. So we also have the sensor on here for our fingertip so we can easily log in and unlock everything on here. Built right off of the laptop's um, mouse pad. We also have a nice area right here where we can kind of rest our palms when we're typing. I always like that. There's a lot of laptops out there that have a small keyboard where it just simply ends right at the end and it just doesn't feel comfortable. So definitely a big fan of the layout here. 17 point inch screen. We're gonna see that in action momentarily, but first let's close this and let's take a look at the available ports on the side. So first off over here, type C cable connection. This is gonna be where we plug in our power supply cable. That's followed by an HDMI port right next to that, USB 3 port, and then we have another USB 4 Type-C port over here. So we can bring in webcams, we can bring in keyboards, a mouse, we can bring in controllers all through those connections over there. Let's flip this around to the other side. Now, this is something that for me as a content creator is huge. We have an SD card slot right there. So we can easily go over, grab a micro SD card in a um, SD adapter like this and just simply slide that in. It clicks right in place. When we want to remove it, it slides right out. So it doesn't get any easier than that for connections. We have another USB-A port followed by another USB-3 port. We have our audio connections over here. So you can go ahead and connect over your headphones. You can connect over a microphone to this as well. So now in terms of speakers here, you'll notice that there really isn't any spot for a speaker on here. We have our power button over here. I don't think I mentioned that before, but no speakers on the sides. The speakers are actually located right on the bottom of 
the laptop itself. So there's a speaker right here, another speaker on the other side, and the edge is a little bit beveled there, so it doesn't sit right flat on a surface. So it does curve up and the speakers are located on that curve. So you don't have speakers and sound going right into the surface that you are laying your laptop on. It is going to kind of fill the area around your laptop. So it should be a good audio experience. Only one way to find out. We got to fire this up, test it out. Let's dive into it. <laughs>
All right, guys, we jumped into this laptop from Nemo, and I love what this offers. First off, layout and design. It's a larger scale laptop than what we typically see these days on the market, yet it's still sleek and very durable. It's all metal, so it's not cheap plastic. Uh, that makes it a little bit heavier, but because it's so thin, I think you can easily still slide this into a backpack and take it with you on the go. Now, I wanna talk about the layout here. Because it is larger, we have room for the numeric pad on here, which I love. I'm always looking for laptops that offer that, and they are hard to come by. Now, we also, with that, obviously have a 17.3 inch screen, which is larger than we typically see for laptops these days as well. Great visuals on here. Even the audio on this laptop is very good. Now, there is some you know restrictions with how loud you can get this, and that makes sense, right? I mean, it's a compact laptop. The speakers are kind of on the underside there. There's no distortions or audio issues, but it doesn't get super loud. So if you're going to use this laptop to watch TV shows with friends or to game with friends, you may want to invest in some external speakers just for an immersive experience for more than one person. But if it's just you watching Netflix, watching YouTube, or playing games, it's going to be more than enough here to have that immersive experience that we all know and love. Now, let's talk about gaming potential here. I threw everything at this. I played retro games on here. I played modern day AAA games. I even played live AAA games. And this thing sails through everything. So there's really no restrictions here when it comes down to gaming. I had a great experience from top to bottom. So it's really cool to have a laptop that's fully portable, well-made, and can handle anything that you throw at it. You can work off of this thing. You can watch movies and TV shows off of this, YouTube. You can live stream off of this. You can edit videos, which I've done as well. And most importantly, you can game on here without restrictions. So great option here. Definitely check it out. I'll provide you guys with a link in the description of this video. That's going to do it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting the channel. Be sure to give me a thumbs up on the video. And of course, hit subscribe to stay in the loop for all future videos right here on the Chase Brogan YouTube channel.